So, we picked up the fairy drop and now we need to go back so we can finish crafting ourselves a new king's sword. Not that that makes a hell of a lot of sense because wouldn't the original sword be what was needed for, you know, proving what we need to prove? Not some reproduction? What fuck, whatever, who cares? Let's go get ourselves a king's sword. There we are. <laughs> Damn it. There we go. <laughs> Can I equip it? I mean, we were able to use the first king sword, weren't we? I can't equip it, but it's worse than what I have. Way worse. Although it does have protect. Eh, whatever. Screws you up a little bit because the king sword in the... The king sword in the original... Uh, Jeez, what the hell am I talking about? The first king sword that we had was a more powerful weapon than we were able to get otherwise. And when it broke, Ryu was essentially like crippled as far as uh, his offensive ability because he couldn't... His weapon was broken. And any other sword you could pick up for a while was significantly inferior. Where was I supposed to go? Weren't... It had this unfortunate side effect, though, of making him... Uh, uh, physical attacks worse than Nina's. And Nina's supposed to be your caster. So you sort of <laughs> made him like third string character. Was I supposed to go to Warrant? I'm not even sure. There we go. Yeah, good luck to me. Okay, so I wasn't supposed to talk to you. Oh, you know what? Uh, I went to the wrong place. <laughs> I wasn't supposed to go to... Warren is supposed to talk to Cray's mother. Off in the desert. Fortunately, I don't have to ride that Nautilus out there. I just sort of map travel my way there. I think this is it. I mean, I have a tail. Okay, no, I'm... And where was this person again? <laughs> God, I'm, uh... It's the downside to playing these games blind. Sometimes you just don't know what to do. Especially given it's been a little while since I've put any time in with this. Ah, shit. Um, give me a minute. Here I am. It's, uh, 
<sighs> oh, okay. It's this town. Shit. Where was I supposed to... Great. I just ran out the other side. Oh, nope. I had to go to the castle. So all of that was for nothing? Hey, he's got nothing better to do. The emulator's all wigging out a little bit. Frame rate keeps dropping. So the, I mean, we definitely had a fake sword, but did the Empire really have a fake sword? Because remember, Ryu broke it on that guy's face and left the blade behind. So maybe they just took the blade and, I don't know, reforged the rest of it or, I don't know. Where's my, uh, where's my room? This isn't it. <laughs> no. I don't want to leave. Tell you what, the, I am really frustrated by the level design in this game. Because it just keeps uh, forcing you to readjust the camera angle. I know I've complained about that before, but I'm probably going to complain about it over and over again. This looks like it might be something that I have to do. <laughs> I wouldn't call the layout, especially the towns, in Breath of Fire 3 sprawling in any way, but they were definitely more open than we're looking at here. And honestly, I probably wouldn't mind it so much if the camera was a little bit freer in terms of control, like we had seen in 
like Xenogears, because in that you can adjust the camera while your characters are moving, as opposed to this where your characters stop whenever you try adjusting the camera. So you can be a little bit quicker with it. Did I go in this one yet? Yes, I did, but I didn't go upstairs. Oh, alright. <laughs> so there we go. Oh, I'm back with Folu again. Of course he's not dead. Am I playing as the antagonist with this guy? Oh, I'm not going to play at him as, a, as him at all? What? Okay. You know, it's nighttime. I feel like this is a part that I should, uh... Hey, hey, do everyone's just hanging out, so. I think I should end the episode here, even though it's relatively short. Because I'm about to get into a dungeon, aren't I? Yeah. Why the hell didn't I play as Fulu at all? Just like one line? And then we switch out? You can see that guy behind the building. 